Hi friends, welcome back to my channel again. So in this video, I'm going to review UBS company. Let's jump into the video friends. So basically friends, I have opened a glass door and I have searched for UBS. So I got uh, these details. So talking about the company, it is headquartered in Zurich, Switzerland. It's founded in 1862, almost a 150 year old company. It is into investment and asset management. It's a fintech company and its competitors are like Deutsche Bank, uh, Credit Suisse and Morgan Stanley. So uh, I have created videos for Credit Suisse and Morgan Stanley. Whenever you get a time, please uh, do explore my channel. And uh, keeping that aside, talking about the company reviews, overall the company is having 3.9 rating, which is almost a better company in the market uh, for now. And remember this guy named Ralph Hammers. So if anyone asks you in the interview about this company, you can tell them like uh, he's a CEO of this uh, UBS. So it will definitely add a great point to you. And uh, keeping that aside, let's talk about uh, individual reviews. So for culture and values, the reviews are uh, 3.9. For diversity and inclusion, it's 4. For work-life balance, it is 3.8. Senior management, 3.4. Compensation and benefits, 3.4. And career opportunities, 3.7. So if you see the trend, uh, these two are like better and this tool are like good and this one and this one are more than good and less than better but uh, as per my knowledge you know this company still has a chance to improve these two things like senior management and uh, compensation and benefits it will definitely help the companies to get a uh, more uh, uh, rating i mean more positive rating and uh, keeping that aside talking about employee sentiments 79 percent of the employees are recommending their friends to join in ubs 89 percent of the employees are approving the ceo and 70% UBS has a positive business outlook. So these are uh, the reviews when it comes to the employee sentiments. And uh, keeping that aside, let's talk about most recent reviews. So we will understand how, how the company is. And uh, sorry, uh, before we start that, uh, we can talk about pros and cons working in this company. So basically, uh, pros are like work-life balance is quite good. Strong opportunities to learn from good, uh, good people. Good IT systems and ability to work from home good culture overall comparing to the other names on the street great place with uh, many great people great workplace with uh, many great work people so uh, work life balance and uh, people are good in this company and all the other things as well and coming to the cons long hours during uh, earning sessions long working hours during peak time quite a bit of uh, red tape but seems standard for virus too much cost cutting to the point where everyone is overworked relatively low pay in terms of bulge brackets packs so if you see uh, the rating was like 3.4 for uh, senior management and 3.4 for uh, compensation and benefits so these are the reasons friends so keep this i mean uh, keep this in mind and talking about the recent reviews well-meaning but flawed management style pros are like some colleagues are both very considerate kind and intelligent cons management style in ceo function heavily speed to recognize European staff globally and within Asia Pacific. So I leave it to you. Uh, and they are not applicable at this moment for the pros. Large organization has more procedures to follow. Recommendable company to work for by quantitative analysts. Career opportunities, good salary and environment. Cons are like old school companies, slow changes across the entire firm. VP in uh, CA, they want to be better in pro. Cons, no value added, sloppy systems, antiquated uh, technology, negative branding. Politics at SQ and low payout. For analysts, investment banking analysts, good work life balance on my team. Cons, vacation and paid time off are too short. So, one of the account data specialists, pros are good work culture, good environment, and good progression. Cons are pay structure and yearly bonus for ops team. So, working in UBS, quantitative analyst, healthy environment, and good work life balance. Cons, smaller company, less interesting jobs available. So basically, uh, friends, if any UBS employee is watching this video, please do comment how good the company is right now. And uh, there are 9,000, approximately 9,000 reviews related to the company. So I recommend you to take a look. So you will understand more about the company. And let's talk about the jobs. So there are uh, 290 jobs posted in the Glassdoor by UBS. Uh, I think these are in India. Uh, but what I recommend is uh, just go with my previous video I have created on how to search, filter and apply for the jobs. I have uh, shown how to individually filter the jobs based upon the location. So I recommend you to take a look and so that will definitely add some great advantage for you. And next let's talk about the salary part. Uh, 
the salary rating was like 3.4 overall when it comes to the salary part but let's see how the company so for software engineer the salary is around uh, 11 lakh for director 50 lakh 50 thousand and analyst salary is 8 lakh software developer salary is uh, 11 lakh and HR salary is like around uh, 8.9 lakh consultant salary 14 lakh data science 12 lakh so I have also shared a job related to the data scientist uh, in my previous video so I recommend you to take a look and apply for that role as well and uh, there are around 60 reviews related to salary friends I recommend you to go with that so you'll understand more about the company and uh, the less salary is like 8 lakh 41 thousand for analyst and uh, 46 lakh 97 thousand is the highest salary that UBS is paying for its employees in India so the, these are the reviews when it comes to the salaries you can filter the salaries based upon the individual role by just uh, editing this thing and uh, keeping that aside let's talk about interviews so when it comes to the interview the difficulty is like 3.0 which is good difficulty range so you need to somehow work out to get a job in this company and leaving uh, keeping that aside interview experience at uh, UBS if you are giving an interview you will get 61% uh, positive 41% negative and 26% neutral experiences is what you can expect if you are giving an interview here and how to get an interview here so if you are applying online uh, you will get 60% chances to get an interview chance and 14% for campus recruitment it is that means for freshers an employee referral 10% if you know someone uh, that will definitely add some weightage to you and let's talk more about the reviews uh, I mean uh, the other sources are like recruitment agency recruiter in person and other those are accumulative 14% but majority of the employees are from the people who are applied online through company website and uh, keeping that aside I recommend you to go with this interview reviews so you'll understand more about the process of interview so let's say for uh, for graduate trainee CDIO interview so the questions are like why do you choose UBS technical questions regarding your experience in your CV and uh, interviews are like online technical interview video interview give and take one to two weeks get notified to attend super day physical chit chat so these are some kind of sessions interview sessions you can think about and uh, keeping that aside so the difficulty is three the hiring process uh, takes averagely 21 days quickest hiring was uh, for software developer in two days and the slowest hiring was for the business analyst in 31 days so what is the interview process like at UBS so some common stages are like one to one interview 23 percent presentation 20 percent group panel 8.21 percent so phone interview 15.33 percent so these are a couple of interview processes that you can uh, expect here in this company if you are giving an interview and next benefits so the benefits are like uh, 3.7 which means it's uh, the benefits are good in this company uh, comparing to another companies in the market available so let's talk more so there are around 50 leaves here uh, both maternity and paternity leaves available sick leaves lots of sick leaves are available so current associate director in Hyderabad salary paid is almost fixed only part is both side pf is included nothing variable apart from this good insurance policy lots of holidays and time off good at doing employee satisfaction all other policies related to remuneration are good in this company and there are 110 reviews related to the benefits i recommend you to go with this friends so you'll understand more about the benefits and next photos um photos will uh, give you some idea on about the campuses the people the culture so i recommend you to take a look when you get some uh, free time and uh, i think that's it for the review part friends and if you ask me whether you can join or not it's a great experience if you can join in this company uh, you'll learn a lot within a short span friends and uh, yeah uh, if any employee UBS employee is watching the video please uh, correct me if anything is wrong and uh, in my upcoming video I will be sharing more uh, relevant information friends until then keep watching my videos and do not forget to subscribe my channel for more future videos thank you and have a great day